everyone in this question we want to find the limit as x approaches 3 of x minus 3 divided by 2 minus the square root of x plus 1 so your first approach should be to try to substitute x equals 3 into your expression let's let x equals 3 and see what happens so we will get 3 minus 3 divided by 2 minus the square root of 3 plus 1 that will give us 0 divided by 2 minus 2, which is 0 on 0. And this is your indeterminate form. So that's telling us to do a bit more work to try to find the limit. Let's write down the limit again. We have the limit as x approaches 3 of x minus 3 divided by 2 minus the square root of x plus 1. What we'll try now is multiply top and bottom by the conjugate of the denominator. So that would be 2 plus the square root of x plus 1 divided by 2 plus the square root of x plus 1. So for our numerator, we'll have x minus 3 times 2 plus the square root of x plus 1. And in the denominator, we'll have 2 squared minus the square root of x plus 1 all squared so just write down the numerator again we'll have x minus 3 times 2 plus the square root of x plus 1 and in the denominator we'll have 4 minus x minus 1 so this denominator can be written as 3 minus x but notice in the numerator you have x minus 3. So we can change the 3 minus x to be a negative x minus 3. So we'll have limit as x approaches 3 of x minus 3 times 2 plus the square root of x plus 1 divided by negative x minus 3. Let's cancel the x minus 3. So we can write the limit as x approaches 3. And we have 2 plus the square root of x plus 1. And we have a negative in front of that. So now it looks like we can try our substitution method again. So we'll have negative 2 plus the square root of 3 plus 1 is 4. So that would give us negative. 2 plus 2, which is negative 4. And this is your final answer to the question. Thanks for watching.